What's up, guys? Long time no see. Oh, my God. NFL all day just dropping bombshells all week long. Let's get into some of the details here. So first thing that NFL all day announced is this brand new playbook. The NFL all day playbook is going to be something to where we can earn rewards as collectors. So you can complete plays. Your weekly tasks are going to be called plays and will vary every week. Some will be as simple as logging in, while others will require you to complete challenges based on NFL game action. With each play you complete, you will earn a certain amount of yardage. Hitting different yardage milestones will earn you specific rewards. Every week, there will be two sets of rewards you can earn in your playbook, free rewards and premium rewards. Free rewards are available to all fans with no need to own any moments on NFL all day. These premium rewards will include epic playbook packs, full of NFL all-day moments featuring the NFL's best highlights. The way to unlock premium rewards will change each week. By doing this, you'll have the opportunity to earn brand new playbook packs. You'll still have to gain the necessary yards to earn the packs. Unlocking just allows you access to the packs that your yardage earns you. The only way to receive packs as rewards is by doing the task required to unlock premium. For week one, this task is to burn five moments from your collection. NFL All Day has also released the brand new Challenge Builder. You can access challenges either by clicking a specific one on your playbook page or navigating to the challenges page on NFL All Day. There will be five different playbook packs as a part of the premium playbook. There's going to be one star, two star, three star, four star, and five star packs, all containing a variety of different moments. For week one, these playbook packs will feature moments from series one, but as we move into this season, Moments will be released from Series 1 and Series 2 in the upcoming playbook packs. If you want to know where to find your playbook, just go ahead and click up here in the corner. And you can see this view playbook. As you can see right here, you can see this is where the premium will be unlocked or locked, depending on if you had completed what was necessary. You can also see the available plays, which will gain you yardage as well as the upcoming plays like these challenges for Thursday night, Sunday night, Monday night, and the end of the week. And up here, it will say when this exact playbook ends. You can also see your yards right here and also the next reward in however many yards. Next thing we're going to get into is the Go For Two challenge that was just released yesterday. How is this going to work? Well, first... NFL All Day is going to airdrop celebration packs featuring three common moments each to all fans who owned at least seven moments as of their recent snapshot at 4.10 p.m. Eastern on Tuesday, September 6th. Only one pack per person. These packs will be called Celebration Series 1 Release 2. After you open your pack and you see which moments you get, you'll have the chance to go for two, which means you can burn the contents of your pack and get airdropped a new fourth and goal reward pack, which is going to feature four moments, which will include three commons, plus a fourth moment that is either common, rare, or legendary. So once you receive your initial celebration pack, you will have to review your moments and decide if you want to burn those moments to receive the fourth and goal pack. If you burn them by 11.59 p.m. Eastern on Friday, September 9th, you will then receive your new fourth and goal pack by 11.59 p.m. Eastern on September 12th. Some of the moments that will be included in these new fourth and gold packs will include some legendary moments from Joe Mixon, Javante Williams, and more. Some all-day debuts from top quarterbacks like Josh Allen, Joe Burrow, and Russell Wilson. Also, electric playmakers like Debo Samuel, Justin Jefferson, and Stephon Diggs. There will also be first career touchdowns from some of last year's top rookies like Mac Jones, Jalen Waddell, Kyle Pitts, Devonta Smith, and Najee Harris. There will also be some memorable moments like Dak Prescott breaking the Cowboys season record for touchdown passes and TJ Watt tying the NFL single season sack record. Will burning this pack help count towards unlocking premium rewards in the week one playbook? Yes, if you burn the moments from this pack by clicking next after you open the pack, those three moments will count towards your playbook requirement, which as I alluded to earlier for week one, you must burn five moments to unlock the premium rewards. Last thing I wanted to touch on a little bit further detail, as I alluded to earlier, is the upcoming plays in your playbook. So right here is where you're going to be able to see some upcoming challenges. Right now, we have the Thursday night challenge for the Bills Rams opening game of the season. You can click the view challenge button right there and it'll tell you the requirements. 
So for the Thursday night challenge for the Bills Rams, you will need four total moments. You're going to need one moment from each of the top three players with the most receiving yards in the Bills Rams game. Also one moment from a D-line, DB, or linebacker who played at least one snap in the game. If you complete this challenge, this will gain you 15 extra yards in your week one playbook. Also to note, you must complete this challenge by Friday, September 9th, 8.30 p.m. Pacific time. Once the Thursday night challenge is over, be sure to head on over to your playbook again and keep your eyes open for the Sunday night or the Sunday slate challenge, the Sunday night challenge, the Monday night challenge, and the end of week challenge. And the final, final thing that I wanted to get into before we end this video is I just want to go over my Rumble lineup real quick for week one. This could always change depending on the Thursday night game. So I got Josh Allen at quarterback, my two running back spots. I got Christian McCaffrey and Alvin Kamara. At wide receiver, I got Cortland Sutton and Juju Smith-Schuster. At tight end, we got Mark Andrews. In the flex, I got Gabriel Davis. And then I got Baltimore in my DST Plus position. All right, that is going to wrap it up for this video. Apologize for the lack of content the past couple of weeks. Uh, we've both been pretty busy. AG actually just got married this past weekend, so we're having a, a great time, having a blast over the past few days. So quick shout out to him. I love you, man. Congratulations once again. I'm super happy for you. Uh, and he's going to actually be on his honeymoon for the next three weeks in Greece. So as far as content goes, no promises, but we'll try to make it work. But again, it's going to be pretty difficult, obviously, with the time change and him just being in a completely different country. And obviously, my schedule over here as far as work goes. So like I said, we'll, we'll, we'll try and see what we can do, but no promises on that front. If you're still watching this video, thank you all for watching. Please hit that like and subscribe button. Uh, feels good to be back. Hopefully, we'll get some more content out in the next few weeks. Let's get ready for some football, baby. It's back. Week one, Bills Rams tonight. Looking forward to a great season. A lot of fantasy degenerate stuff going on this year. So really looking forward to it. As always, good luck collecting out there. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.